After being Marine for 13 years, I decided to join Navy Medicine to be a physician with Marines, primarily to uh, get more involved in military medicine to take care of the Marines on the battlefield. Um, I started as a family medicine doc in the, in the Navy, and uh, during this time I, I spent a lot of tours and deployments with Marines as a, a GMO and a regimental surgeon. Uh, later on, I did a second residency in occupational medicine, uh, primarily to deal with the hazards that the Marines and sailors deal with every day on the different bases and as they perform their duties as a, as a sailor. As a Navy medicine physician, I have a lot of unique opportunities that my civilian counterparts may have difficulty um, finding. Uh, not only do I serve overseas as um, a provider and caregiver for our military members and their families, but I can also participate in global health engagements, uh, humanitarian efforts in, in different countries, all in support of our nation. Navy Medicine uses global health engagement to help our partner nations build their capability while at the same time provide an opportunity for Navy Medicine professionals to hone their skills in an unfamiliar resource constraint environment overseas. I think a civilian physician would find it very re rewarding to be a Navy physician, uh, primarily because having a career in Navy Medicine allows you to have multiple and various opportunities. You can deploy overseas, take care of family members, take care of the military in remote environments, uh, go on global health and humanitarian missions overseas, as well as work in different hospitals, clinics, medical centers all throughout the United States, uh, working with uh, international colleagues, working with colleagues from different services in the United States military, and at the same time keeping your, your skills um, up, to, up to date and honing your, um, your knowledge base by working in different facilities with different providers.